during that, in the, 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 again, the fall of 1983, I went to, one day I went to Tom to, to, to meet up with Tom uh, in the colonnade over at, uh, at St. Peter's, uh, probably around one o'clock in the afternoon, a little bit later, after, again, after the Vatican had, had closed. And um, so Tom was there doing his usual thing, which was writing prayers, collecting prayers, uh, uh, reading current events, and uh, uh, collecting uh, information on social and political problems in the world, uh, and marking them down, and bringing, then he would bring them into church with him and pray for all of those intentions. Mm -hmm. And um, so he said to me, he said, Claude, right now in the United States, there's a man who has the hand of God on him. He has the IQ of a genius and a, a first-class education, and everything he approaches, he attacks with a blinding efficiency. So I said, well, gee, you know, I thought that was interesting. I said, well, Tom, who is it? And he goes, his, his name is Donald Trump. And I said, uh, I said, Tom, I said, I said, yeah, I said, I've heard of Donald Trump. I said, but, but Thomas, he's, He's kind of like this jet-setting playboy millionaire. I said, he, you know, he dates Hollywood starlets, and uh, he's always in the news with the, uh, you know, with the, with the, the, the glitterati. And he said, no, Claude. He said, I'm telling you, the hand of God is on him, and God is going to use him in the future. 